make sure we got all the settings correct. Um, the biggest thing is the gimbal release. This uh, uh, Inspire does not have a 360 gimbal. It stops. Um, so DJI incorporated a software fix so that you could rotate 360 and that keeps right on going. Um, Alright, now let me see if I can find, it's in the MC settings, oops, uh, general settings, um, here, advanced settings, and gimbal endpoint auto release, aircraft return a circle to release when gimbal is reaching movement limit. This gimbal end point auto release is only available when aircraft is over three millimeters above the ground. So make sure that's on. You'll be kind of surprised what happens. The uh, Inspire will, when it reaches the gimbal end point, it will suddenly rotate 360. And you can see it on your on your screen. Uh, the rotation, but in the actual film on the camera, it's transparent. So that is really amazing how DJI has uh, done this software fix for uh, lack of a 360 gimbal. Okay. I'm going to pan the camera around. When it reaches the end point, and there we go. See what happens. I can continue panning it around. The aircraft simply spins. It's really amazing for DJI to reach the, uh, to make the 360 with a gimbal that's not a 360 gimbal. Alright, All right, it's tracking. Go up a ways. 